Man, it's your old pal Uncle Noli, back with more answers to all your questions. Here we go. Our first question comes from Maestro4276. Hey, Uncle Noli, what's the best way to make a sandwich, if you know what I mean? Well, Maestro, I don't know what you mean, unless it's, uh, you put your favorite things between two pieces of bread. Then you eat it. It's called a sandwich. Is that what you mean? I don't think that's what you mean, but that's what I mean. Sandwich. Uncle Nole knows sometimes. Our next question comes from Lisa. Dear Uncle Noli, my parents don't know that I am gay and I have a girlfriend. Should I tell them that I am gay? Oh, well, Lisa, this is a very tricky situation you got yourself here. Uh, now listen, you have a girlfriend, you're proud to be gay, you should be proud to be gay, and that's fine. Coming out to your family, I can understand, it's a difficult thing. Some people are gonna understand, some aren't. But at some point, you gotta realize that this is your life and your happiness, okay? And you know, maybe you, you gotta give your family the benefit of the doubt. Your parents love you, and no matter what your sexual preference is, all right? Hey, your Uncle Noli loves you, so you already got one down, okay? Two more to go. Now, if they aren't very nice about it and they got a problem and they want to come after me, tell them I got people. I got people. Boom. Uncle Noli knows. Our next question comes from Meister. Hey, Uncle Noli, my dog wants to go on a haunted tour of the scary abandoned lighthouse. I get scared quite easily in dark and small places. What should I do? Hmm. Ah, uh, well, Meister, or should I say Shaggy, uh, maybe you should stop listening to your dog and uh, go do what the hell you want, all right? Give him a bone. Dog wants to go to a haunted house. Freak. scooby dooby doo Uncle Nole knows. Our next question comes from Austin C. Uncle Noli. I am sort of fat and want to lose weight. What's your best advice? Well, Austin, I applaud your uh, your initiative here. Okay, if you're a little pudgy and you want to lose weight, you got to remember diet and exercise. And the most important thing of that is your diet. You got to cut down the carbs, add up the protein, you know, but you got to not just go on a diet. You, you got to make it a lifestyle change, all right? You just eat less and, and, and burn more calories. It's a simple, simple, uh, you know, chemical uh, uh, balance that you got to find. You know what? But hey, take your time, be patient, and it'll happen. You know, but, uh, you know, Uncle Noli's uh, done it a few times. Up and down like, uh, like I'm going on an escalator with my weight. But here's the deal. You know what? You put your mind to it, you get anything done. All right? Put your mind to it. You can do it. Boom. Uncle Noli knows. Our next question comes from Joaquin017. Uncle Noli, what fun activities do you suggest for a 20-year-old turtle? He never moves. Joaquin, I don't know how to tell you this, but turtles of all ages move somewhat. There's a good chance your turtle's dead. Check for a pulse. Uncle Noli knows. Matthew Reviews writes, My friends are making fun of me because I shaved my hair off. What do I do to stop them from making fun of me? All right, Matthew, it's very simple here. You got three choices, okay? A, you get new friends. B, you put on a hat. C, you wait. Hair grows back. Simple. Uncle Noli knows. Katie London writes, Dearest Uncle Noli, I recently got into a relationship with a guy, but we haven't broken the fart slash burp seal yet. Any advice for breaking that seal spectacularly? Katie London, you're not going to be in this relationship long if you break that seal. Ever. Uh, it's very simple. Girls don't fart and burp. Guys do. And then they break that seal. Some of them think it's funny. And if your guy does that, break up with him. He's a pig. It's gross. All right? Let's keep our bodily functions to ourselves. All right? Excuse yourself. Uh, go in another room, go outside. Hell, I don't care. Get a dog. Blame it on him. It's fine. Dogs can fart and burp. Couples don't. All right? 21 years with the missus. Not even sure she has a butthole. Just saying. Boom. Uncle Nole knows sometimes. Our next question comes from Mexicanabus. <laughs> Uncle Noli, 
What is the right way to eat an Oreo? Oh, this is a great question, Mexicanabis. I bet you like those you know, Oreos after you've uh, been uh, smoking some of that Mexicanabis, right? <laughs> yeah, I know. Anyway, a lot of people have their own way about eating an Oreo, all right? You, you take the two apart, uh, you, you look the cream out, whatever you want to do. Here's what I do. Get about nine of them, throw them in a glass, fill that glass with milk, grab yourself a spoon, and enjoy the, the sugar rush that you're going to have and the nap that you will uh, come after. All right? <laughs> Oreos. Double stuff. Uncle Noli knows. Candlelight writes, Dear Uncle Noli, how may I keep my spirits high even though 2020 has been such a shitty year? Oh, candlelight. Hang in there. Have patience. It's almost over. 2021. Look forward. Light at the end of the tunnel. Vaccines. Maskless friends. Uh, gatherings. Sports. Concerts. It's all going to be okay. Just need a little more time. Stay safe, stay healthy. For God's sakes, wear a mask and stay six feet away from people. Come on. Stupid. Uncle Noli knows. Justin Bellavia writes, Dear Uncle Noli, should I manscape? I'm a hairy Italian. Yes, you should manscape. Why? Because you're a hairy Italian. You answered your own question. Uncle Noli knows. Our next question comes from Bobby Thomason. Uncle Noli, I have a crush on my cousin, but I don't know what to do. Simple, Bobby. Move to the Ozarks and get married. Boom! Redneck jokes. Uncle Noli knows. Hey, kids, that's all the time we have for this week. Thanks for joining me on Advice from Uncle Noli. Keep those questions coming, because I got all the answers. And nothing else to do. Nothing. Thank you.